Okay guys, we're back. Still in this problematic position. Uh, gosh darn it. Still wondering if we should cheat here. Yes, I have not actually decided what to do here, to be honest. Because... I don't know, I don't like cheating. I really don't. Hmm. But I'm feeling like I might have to. Sooner or later. Because I don't get any sense out of this at all. So I did open, a, open up a walkthrough and kind of scroll to the part where this is the thing. Can we scroll to it please? Yes, we can. Good. Uh, I used the V-shaped piece and arrow piece. Look up, find a hole in the stash. Okay, wait, wait. Now place the red crystal on the spot with the circle around it on the right side of the statue. Then put the yellow and blue crystals in stages to hands. Haven't I tried all of those combinations already? Pretty sure I had. Now I can't even remember which stone it was. Was it the red one I was supposed to place there? Oh, so I haven't tried that combination. I'm a genius. Well, <coughs> I'm guessing that will end this mystery here. And that will probably end this chapter. Uh, this episode is so far very short. So in that case, I think I'll continue on to the next chapter. Such a sad day that we have to cheat. Such a bad, sad thing that I missed that combination. <laughs> Presuming we'll do like this and this. It won't go in. I wonder if I have to put them together first. Well, that was a good hint at least. We meet the monster now. What I think happens is that we will change and we will, we will go into the place where the princess are, if I remember correctly. Because when you change between worlds. No, maybe not. Uh. Troll is as a troll does. Chapter 2. It's going well. Princess Drusilla now looks like a troll. Welcome, most beautiful of princesses. <gasps> mm? Doesn't seem to like that much. <gasps> Who? Even Who are you, he's sir? Still a troll. I, uh, I am King Otar Fenris III, I guess he's into... ruler of the Volcanics Underground, and you are the Princess Rosella, yes? I guess he's into best I am, Your Majesty. How do you know me? Where am I? I saw a beautiful castle before. Where could I find it, please? Castle? Oh, that. It's a dull place. You wouldn't like it. Oh my, I wasn't expecting this. You're a troll yourself, what the hell? Majesty, what weren't you expecting? What's going on? He's very polite, don't you think? He's among I trolls and... I wasn't expecting you to be so lovely, my lady. You will be the most radiant bride in all the world. Bride? 
See here, King Otar, I'm, I'm, I'm very honored and all, but I can't marry you. I, I don't even know you. Now, <clears throat> if you'll excuse me. I wouldn't be honored if a random troll guy went up to me and said, like, I want to marry you, or you're going to marry me. I wouldn't be flattered at all. Not honored. I'm a... I'm a... I'm a... A troll, dear lady. Shouldn't you be happy? A troll? Please don't be sad, princess. You make a lovely troll. I guess that's a simply stunning that's troll. That's all trolls. Marry a normal I'm human. I'm a troll. Human. How can I be a troll? I'm not a troll, am no, I? No, you're nice, princess. Don't worry about Come it. Come along, princess. Let me escort you to your chamber. Perhaps you'll feel better if you rest. A troll? I'm such a troll. It's a hard life. Troll, huh? What is she? She's like the racist troll that hates humans then? And she's like, this is not a real troll. A troll? I can't believe I'm a troll! And not just any troll. Oh no, I'm engaged to the troll <laughs> king! How lucky can a girl get? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me guys for coughing. Um I'm still a bit sick. Hi, looking at me. Troll King, so handsome. Blah. I might need to brush your teeth. Having a golden tongue is usually not very good. Can you do anything more with this mirror? We have nothing in our inventory. Blah. Nothing to make us cry when we think of our dear mother. Oh. Ew. That's enough to give our castle decorator a case of the vapors. What is the case of the vapors? I can I know what vapors are. Is it like saying that someone has bad stomach issues? And I don't know if my microphone picked this up, but my stomach very perfectly started growling a lot at that moment. Uh, there's the hate at all. Who are you, Missy? You're no real troll. I can see right through. Racist. You. What do you want with King Otar, you human minx? I, I don't want anything. I was just looking into this pool and, and then I saw this. Baloney, little girl. You're trying to steal the throne of the underground. Usurper, usurper! <laughs> Why, you're no usurper. You poor little thing. Don't cry. I didn't mean to be cross. It's just that King Otar has been so strange lately, and that a horrible woman has been snooping around. I'm not crying. Typical racist, just blame it on everyone else. Of course you're not, dear. Now you listen to me. I can help you turn back into a human. You can? Are you an enchantress? Well, not exactly. I'm Matilda, and I used to be King Otar's nursemaid when he was just a wee troll. Anyway, I can give you a list just of ingredients for a magic potion that will turn you back into a human just like that. But you have to do something for me. Anything. Up above this kingdom is a dark land called Ooga Booga. Our kingdoms were never crazy about each other, but we had a civil relationship. Now, because of her, the Ooga Boogaites attack any troll that shows a face above ground. Missy, once you're human, you will go above and investigate. I have a gut feeling that our kingdom is in terrible trouble. Of course I will, Matilda. Wonderful. Now listen, girl, bring me some baked beetles, a crystal dragon scale, water of emerald, a silver spoon, and a gold bowl. Got it? Got it. No. I didn't get it. Stupid old toy rat. This is not what I wanted. I wanted a battle. Yeah, 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 I do completely understand that. 
Oh my god, I'm going, I'm going to sneeze. Not that please. So, I guess we'll want that rat then, for some reason. <clears throat> yeah, it's beautiful, beautiful 3D. Voice acting is not very good in this game. I mean, if if you call someone a wee troll, I mean, it's not going to sound American, is it? Shouldn't she, the racist troll, be super mad about that, by the way? Okay, I'll take this. Oh yeah, we can. What were we supposed to get? A silver spoon and... Can I ask her again? Matilda? What was that list of uh, ingredients again? You. Baked beetles, a crystal dragon scale, a gold bowl, water of emerald, and a silver spoon. Got it? Yes, ma'am. Can I get a list like in modern games? This is too hard. Was this where we came from, by the way? Oh yeah, it was. <coughs> oh, 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 oh. Revolting beast. Quite so. So rude. Jeez, oh God. You nearly got yourself fried. Oh, I'm not scared of that nasty wind. I could break her in half like a carrot. Well, that's good, because she's right behind you. That's a typical troll. <laughs> Say whatever you like, and then when real trouble comes your way, just flee. Ah. That was not funny, wrong time. Yes, it was really funny. Perfect picture of a troll. Can I mock you now? Pardon me, sirs, but who was that tall, imposing woman? Uh, her name is Malisha, and uh, to tell you the truth, lady, uh, no one really knows who she is. I know who she is. She's a fiend, that's who. Shut your mouth, Hogarth. You don't know nothing. Some trolls say Malisha is an evil fairy cast out of Etheria up there in the clouds. All I know is she never used to hang around here, and now she does all the time. I hate that one. I'd like happens. to tell you more, pretty lady, but we better not. You better not, because you're a guy that seems to know a lot. Is you could tell me about Malisha? Doubt it. Uh, no, lady. Uh, sorry. No, no way. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, like you'd know anything more. Maybe this guy would. Not this guy. Can I ask him? Is there yeah. anything more you could tell me about Malisha? Uh, no, lady. Uh, sorry. No, no way. Can I scare you with this? With this? No. Okay, let's leave her. That was useless. Uh, is there anything else I can grab here? No. Right, okay, let's go here. Now I cook. Let's guess we're going to use the rat because we always use the rat. All right then, just a touch of frog lips. In Monkey Dash Island, all kinds of games with the, the chef. It's <laughs> always the rat. So let's guess the rat. <laughs> because I'll use pursue. Oh. That's why we're going here. A bit burn out. You are so wonderful. You are the most beautiful stew in the world. All you need is a juicy bat or a tender rat. Oh, yeah. A rat. How surprising. Oh, I'm 
sorry. I didn't mean any... Out, out, out of my kitchen, you dreadful peasant. The dreadful peasant? I'm the princess. I'm going to marry the troll king. I'll get you executed, you... What did you used to do? Wow. Don't worry, my little stew. You're safe from that dreadful girl. Her peasant lips will never touch you. Aren't you going to serve it to someone then? The, pe the peasant lips will never touch you. Well, I'm no peasant. I'm a princess. I'm going to fool you, you stupid peasant. Anyone with brains would be able to tell that this was not rad, but you won't. What's going on? Who's there? A juicy tender rat. Just what I need for my stew. Come here, Jeez. you little tidbit. Revenge. Oh, there they go. But do you get married to the troll king? I will have you executed. Such nerve. Oh, I got my raffi. Oh, I have plenty of things I can do in here. What fun. They could cook a moose in there. <laughs> Gosh, they probably are. First of all, no, they couldn't because that's a pretty small oven and mooses are huge. Um, second of all, that's not how a moose sounds. What's this? A ball. Okay. Nice. I already have a brass ball. Okay. Nice. Um. Supposed to give some of those to her, right? It is something I would not have understood from my. That's enough to give a person nightmares. From what I knew about English when I was a kid, that would have been impossible. Okay, I'm not going to do anything with this dude. Perhaps for a fat juice of rat in it? Okay. Mm. I'm not letting him out. No way. No, it got locked then, did it? He's a genius. Is there anything else to do in here right now? Uh, uh, shut up down here. Hello. Uh, the bowl, girl, the bowl. I don't have a bowl, I have a brass bowl. I see you found the bowl, Rosella. Well, where's the water of emerald? Uh, I guess I forgot that part. I'll be right back. Wait, wasn't that a brass bowl? Oh, let's go here. <clears throat> I hope that doesn't sound too loud for you guys. Oh. Yeah. That's some nasty water. Yeah, you sure think that a lot of things are nasty, princess. Wow. You could melt rocks in there. Yeah, I'm sure. Pardon me, sir, but I was wondering. Okay, it's burning. Well, wonder no longer, sweet potato. I am the troll of your dreams. Ugh. Uh, now see here, I'm I'm uh, I'm engaged to the king. That's right, the king. Oh well, I respect King Ota. You you can bet on that. Uh, I'm sorry, my little rutabaga, but our love is not to be. You let me know if he dumps you, okay? Yeah. 
Ugh. I want to hit this guy. Not in a nice way. Yeah. Doesn't that guy understand a no? Is there something I can touch? May I just borrow these tongs for a few minutes, sir? I just can't let you do that, Sugar Lips. How about a smooch instead? No, thanks. Your last cookie nose. It's not very polite. Let's talk to this guy. Looks way nicer. Excuse me. I didn't mean to startle you, sir. I am Rosella of Daventry. Oh, that's all right. I don't mind being interrupted by someone as charming as yourself. What can I do for you? Why, you're the most polite troll I've ever met. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... Don't apologize, my dear. I quite understand. I can't tolerate the company of most other trolls myself. Oppy Goldsworth, Master Jeweler, at your service. You don't like other trolls? You must be so lonely, Oppy. Get together. Oh, I am, Rosella. To tell you the truth, I'd do anything to leave this place. I'd love to go out and make my way in the world. Maybe I'd even become the court jeweler of Etheria. Hmm. Why don't you? I don't have the money. All I have to my name is this old chipped hammer and chisel. Pardon me, my dear, but I really must finish this project. I don't know, do we need to kill him? I should let the poor guy work. He's so jumpy. Jumpy? He didn't seem jumpy. He seemed more confident than all of the others, I thought. <coughs> what do we have there? It smells like rotten eggs in here. Ah, oh, the word you really must be the most common word in her vocabulary. Ugh, what's this? Green water? Is that what you say? Oh. Bowl with green water. Okay, useful. where that rotten egg smell is coming from. Wow, she that's really the main world word in her vocabulary. What are you doing? Wow! What an updraft. Can you maybe go there? Jump over? <coughs> oh wow, that's the worst jump I've ever seen. How hard was that just to step over that little stone in the middle? Really? Over there. I guess I got a little too close <coughs> to the edge. Oh my god. This girl is no Lara Croft, that's for sure. Yeah. Okay guys, after a billion ewes and a very, very disappointing... <laughs> oh my god, how could someone do that? I am noticing that my voice is a bit shocked and I need to cough a little. So I'll be back, but I hope you enjoyed this episode. And let me watch the next one. Even if you don't, I will keep on playing this game. So at least I'll see myself next time. And I hope I'll have some friends with me. Okay, this is Frank. Bye.